Howdy folks, JD here again with Pinky Custom Shop. Just finished building this base for my buddy Russ Reshaw. So here's the story. His wife, is a lot like my wife in the way that they shop is, they like to find bargains. So so she likes to go, or his wife likes to go to the Amazon return stores, you know, where they, they sell something for, you know, $10 on Wednesday, $8 on, you know, and then Saturday it's like a dollar or something. So she found these base necks for like, I think he said five bucks a piece. He bought like three, she bought like three of them. I guess they didn't fit the bases the guys were trying, but they were perfectly good necks. So he gives me this neck and he goes, build me a base. I go, okay. So of course the neck, um, you know, I did all my stuff on it. I massaged it and got it planned really nice. Put a new bone nut on it and stuff. And then I had this really nice piece of swamp ash, super lightweight swamp ash that I made the body out of. So he, he kind of wanted it to sound sort of like his, uh, he has a, a five string Tobias that was made, it was made back in the early nineties by Gibson. But he wanted a bass similar to that, but he wanted it with a wider neck. So we decided to, to kind of configure it similar to that. So I did the measurements on his bass, I bought some um, Bartolina pickups for it and Audio preamp. This one has a uh, volume pan and a mid, and then it's got treble and bass stacked right here. Um, and it has an old carbon bridge that I had laying around. So let's see what it sounds like. I'm going to boost the highs a bit, boost the bass just a tiny bit. to the bridge. Mm-hmm. 
screwless control cover and you can just pop this off there's the battery here's the battery release here's your audio preamp in there Also do a. Um, I'm gonna edit the uh, the build video on it and post that as well. That I figured I might as well go ahead and post this. All right, guys. Thanks.